Welcome back. We're still playing some more Mother 3. Um, Alex, where, yeah. did, where, did, where did we leave off last time on Mother 3? Uh, well, Flint went to uh, save some dude's kid um, from a burning building. Yeah, that was pretty, and, uh, pretty good. Put that cowboy. kid's safety over the safety of his own family. Yeah, um, maybe. Well, he—I think he didn't. He may not have known his family was traveling today, and it's uh, now he's getting very worried. Yeah, but you know, if you knew that there was a fire burning in like a forest nearby, if it was me, I would have checked on my family first and foremost before worrying about anything else. Mm. Thomas um, is running around with his siren again, and he says, "This is bad, real bad." And now, when the kids still aren't back, uh oh, don't panic. Don't in the way, Thomas. <laughs> Useless oath. Looks like everyone went to the prayer sanctuary. I really want to help you out, honest, Hick. I'm uh, totally just the guy to help you out. What? Where'd he go? Did he just run away? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, Do you think the bell guy? Oh, yeah, he is. Oh, sick. Love the bell guy. He's still can't talk to him though. He just stands there and fixes his glasses. Hmm. Alright. Uh, it's this way. Oh, there you are, Flint. I asked everyone to split up and search the forest for Hinawa. You've been blessed with kind friends. That must be true happiness, in one sense. Hmm. That's a pretty dramatic thing to say. It is a dramatic thing to say. Maybe he's trying to provide me with some comfort in this stressful time. Wes, I'd like to join the search, but they told me to stay here because I'm too old. Seems nobody aware- nobody is aware of just how strong I really am. Hmm. I believe you, Wes. Can you recruit him into the party? Yeah, join the party, Wes. No, he's not gonna do it. Oh, <laughs> yeah, let's see. Was he the guy who was um, praying at the sanctuary before? He just... I forgot. Brr, that's cold rain. I don't like it. It doesn't seem like it's ever gonna stop. Well, at least it put out the fire. <clears throat> Hanawa promised she'd teach me how to make delicious omelets. It's oh. uh, kind of neat. The trees are not burned down. Yeah, let's look at that. Or maybe we aren't in the section that got really, uh... Uh, true. I'm not sure. Ooh. I hit wow. twice. Nice. Oh. There's also, like... I mean, I think it will come up later. Um, but there's apparently, like, a rhythm component to this battle system. Like, if, if you, um, press the button in time with the music, you'll get like bonus damage or bonus hits but oh, I think I it's kind of hard to do oh. I don't know how to do it <laughs> plus there might be like the emulator may not be perfectly um... calibrated yeah to... you know but we can keep working on that as we play through oh. Hello. and each enemy is a different song too so it's like a different rhythm for everyone yeah, I really like Mr. Batty's song. <laughs> yeah, it's funny. Wait, every enemy has a different song? Uh, maybe not every enemy, but there was different tracks. Hanama seems to have a good head on her shoulders. Not you, though. You're pretty careless, so I bet you forgot to bring antidotes with you into the forest, despite the fact the place is teeming with mighty, bitey snakes everywhere. Here, you can have one of my antidotes. <laughs> Look at her, like, <laughs> expressions, too. Like, she's, like, waving her hand and stuff. If you don't think that'll be enough, you can always get some more at Isaac's house. Uh, thanks, I guess. Backhanded compliment, lady. Oh, the yams are awakened. Also, it's, uh, there's still some debris on the ground, but yeah, it doesn't seem that burned. Oops. I got snaked. A mighty bitey snake. How about this track? Scurvy. God, that snake 
Something's trying to swallow your dog whole. Hmm. Bunny leveled up. I didn't realize it before, because the flames were so intense at the time. But it looks like this area over here got hit really bad by the fire too. Oh yeah, wasn't there like some stuff here we couldn't go this way? Yeah. This just has to be the way we're supposed to go. Oh no. Reggie, a fire then rain. And then children smiles. It'll be alright. Reggie knows it. Hmm. Thanks, Reggie. Yeah. Yeah, there's the rhythm. You see, I did it. Wow, yeah. So you, like, hit a button every time. You just had to, yeah, it. when they're attacking, you kind of, like, keep... You can hear my... With the... You keep pressing it with the with the beat. I see. Yeah, I couldn't actually hear it yeah, before at all. It's not the loud one. It's doing a really good, yeah. I switched to the quieter controller. Whoops! It's a yam. A baked yam. <laughs> Oh, a baked yam monster. <laughs> that's I guess great. The fire. Yeah, that's that's pretty good. I wonder what the beat of this one is. Oh, I got it. Maybe this is synced up. Wow. That yeah, made me feel really cool. cool. Yeah. You know. It was small amounts, but you know, it's okay. A baked yam. <laughs> We're eating the monster. How do we feel about this? Oh, there's a present here. The forest still smells burnt. Well, I guess it was a pretty big fire and all. Let's hurry and find Tanawa so she can make us some of her special omelets. Excuse me, I'm trying to... Present? Antidote. Okay. I didn't get poisoned. We're fine. Those mighty bitey snakes are no match for me. <laughs> oh, wow, good dodging. Thank you. I had to be careful about dodging too much though, because oh, it's this weird lady. What oh, do you? Yeah, because we need to start grinding experience. And yeah, stuff like you're gonna get in trouble if you skip too much. Claus is a troublemaker, so I bet he's hiding around here somewhere, watching us worry our heads off. But Lucas is a crybaby, so I bet he's probably in tears by now. Oh. Oh, Lucas. Oh, shoot. Oh, good. I thought it was going to be like the red one. Surprise attack. Alright, not bad. Cool that Boney has his own, like, attack sounds that plays when he, uh, he goes, attacks on Rhythm. Yeah, yeah, that's great. <laughs> Such a, like, charming game. Honestly, yeah. very charming. Yeah, it's really well done so far. Clint opened the present. Beef jerky! Mmm. You could go for that. Or maybe some turkey jerky. We've been calling their names for a while, but there's still no response at all. Do you think maybe they're not in this area? This is concerning. A mini mini charm. What's that? Can you equip that? Maybe. To be equipped on the body defense plus two. Oh yeah, sure, let's equip it. Should we equip it on Boney or ourselves? Let's go with Boney. Boney doesn't have a lot of HP actually. Oh, but he already has a- oh, oh he's wait, got was, a good oh, wait, item on his body, yeah. yeah. Boney is fine. Okay, yeah, it's cool for us, yeah. Mm. Cool. Um, should we use an item though to heal a little bit? Yeah, it seems reasonable. Um. You're still okay, but how's Boney? Oh, actually, we're both still alright. Boney just doesn't have a lot of total HP. Alright. I'm sure Claus and Lucas will come racing here before long to have some of those slightly unclean and not very tasty cookies of mine. <laughs> Throw back to the slightly unclean and not very tasty cookie. <laughs> Do I still have that in my inventory? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, thank you. <laughs> it's just a slightly worse healing item, I think, is the joke. <laughs> oh, what's all these marks on the ground? <laughs> the toe. Actually, it looks like someone went and snapped these in half, not lightning. But that can't be possible. Hanawa's father lives right past here, but... Flint, what should we do? Dramatic lightning. Wow. 
can't believe my eyes. Just look at this one. These huge trees were snapped right in two. How could such big trees get ripped down like this? There's one thing for sure. Whatever did this, it wasn't human. And no, it wasn't me. What? <laughs> what do we do now? They have the path completely blocked. Actually, Hanawa and the kids might still be stuck out there because of all these knocked down trees blocking the way. Even if it's not the most direct path, we should look for another way around. It's probably best if we split up into a few groups. Alright. Bye, guys. Hey! Oh, hey, look! He's back already! Oops. Weren't you, like, break break your leg? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, really. Didn't, didn't you... Were you... Are you okay? He's carrying that 4x4 four four again. <laughs> Have you and Hanawa and the kids? Have you fa sorry, have you found Hanawa and the kids? Lighter? Are you sure you're in good enough shape to be out here? <laughs> I'm always in good enough shape. Don't treat me like some injured clod. Oh, what a clod. What is just gonna destroy this tree with his two by four? We'll take care of things here. Just keep pushing on ahead, Flint. I guess they're gonna try to clear the path while we go on. These two seem like a dependable bunch. Isaac and, uh, uh, Lighter. Yeah, I'm like Thomas. I hope Hinawa is alright. This is Jackie. <laughs> you think this is Jonal or Yonal? I'm gonna uh, go with Yonal. I'd say Jonal. Jonal? Uh, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, let's do Yonal. Yonal and the others are all gathered at the bottom of the cliff over there. I wonder if something's happened. Seems ominous. Please be careful out there. Give my regards to the next frog. I always forget. All the forest critters are acting weird, and I'm suddenly getting really bad vibes here. Shout out to the vibes. Oh no, I mean that in a good way. What I mean to say is, I'm getting good bad vibes, if that makes sense. Thump thump. Does that mean he's trying to backtrack? Because he's worried about how I'm going to take that. Yeah. It's just a guess, but I'd say a drago climbed up from here. That adds up. Hmm. See those claw marks? These most certainly belong to a drago. But why would a drago claw at stuff like this? Enough to leave gashes in rock, even. They're such peaceful creatures. I get the feeling something very bad is happening into the forest, the people, the animals, and me. Oh, this was, like, I think, the guy in the sanctuary. That's a reference to his earlier prayer. <laughs> hmm. Well, we can't go this way, right? One is just sort of like, uh, they're always so specific in the way they respond to everything. Pony found something! Uh -oh. Aww. What is it, Boney? Flint, I think Boney found something. Aww. Oh, look up there. There's a scrap of cloth. Don't you see it? There's a bit of red right over there. That's Hanawa's dress color. What is it? Is there something on top of this cliff? Old man West, what are you doing here? Sorry to say, but there's nothing a rickety old man <laughs> can do to help us out. Rude! <laughs> Everyone is so rude at this game. Oh, Flint. Don't tell me you intend to climb this cliff. I know how you feel, but scaling this cliff face is just too dangerous. But you know, 
Maybe my son could be of use. I don't know if it will help any, but let's get him here so he can try. I'll need to borrow Boney for a bit. Aw, bye Boney. Boney, bring my son back here. My son's name is... Oh. Oh. Duster. A strange but nice guy with unexpected skills. I remember this guy. This I, I ended my um, other playthrough while playing this guy, so I think we're catching up pretty quickly. His name is Duster. Got that? Here, have a sniff of this sock. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> don't forget this smell now. Whimper. That's right, Paul, right? <laughs> Go find that smelly guy. I've tied a yellow ribbon to your collar. Show him the ribbon, and he'll know exactly what's going on. Now fetch! You can count on me! Aw. What a good dog. Wow, are we gonna play as Brody now? Oh, there he goes! Oh, well, he's really going. Through the storm in the night. Bony! Wow, a hero. A hero. Got in. Wow. Wake up. Wake up, Duster. Why has Duster got all these presents on his floor? <laughs> What's wrong with this guy? <laughs> I guess we don't get those presents. <laughs> He's very sleepy. He's very sleepy. Oh. Oh, he woke up. Duster, at long last, it is time to put the thief skills you've studied since childhood to the test. <laughs> He's a thief? Uh, um... Now, show us your wall staple technique, right here, right now. I did study that technique, but this is my first time using it for real. I hope this works. What a weird walk. Uh, maybe he's Is just maybe like, he's got a limp. About who wants to be a thief? <sighs> kind of seem that's the vibe I'm getting. This area looks scalable here. You could tell because of the stripe. Oh. What the heck is going on? Staple sounds. The human stapler. Wow. Well, a ladder. Now we can go up. All right, that should do it. Flint, be careful coming up. Uh, I don't think Boney can climb the ladder, can he? Oh, maybe he can. Wow, what a dog! Boney is a talented dog. Boney is dog. a talented dog. <laughs> Looks like the rain stopped. I have a slight leg handicap. Oh, he does have a limb. Uh, but I'll do my best. Please take me with you. Absolutely, Duster. Thanks for the staples. What a guy. What a guy. Slightly strange, but nice guy with unexpected skills. <laughs> unexpected skills. Oh, yes, we want to see. Gang's all here. All right. Wow. It's the same color as Sanawa's dress. Uh-oh. Is there blood on the inside of that cave? Got a scrap of cloth. What? What? Oh, because there's, there's a couple of like reddish pixels there, yeah. But yeah. I think that's just shading. I yeah, hope it's just shading, I hope man. it's just shading. Should I go in the cave first? Yeah, it looks like it's it. It's just my art style. That's a plotty. Let's try this way. Oh. Hi. Hi. Wow. You encountered a mischievous mole. 
just like flipping a coin. I then. love them. Yeah, it's a good. That's a good guy right there. I would protect this mole with my life. I will beat this mole to death. Oh, the beat is fast. Anyway, okay, no problem. Get out of here. Get out of here. Bash him. Ooh, goody. That bird. Oh, there's more. So does this game ever teach you about the rhythm mechanic? I think it mentions it at some point, yeah. Um. Get out of here. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna save again because I'm pretty sure there's a tough encounter right here. I think this is like... Yeah, they're giving us an entire party. Yeah. I think there's some stuff going on. Hey, Flint! There's someone here! What the... Oh. Are these the aliens? What are those? Are they human? Pig suit Nazis? What are they doing? Get your cowboy hat on straight. Pig panic. Oh! Oh. The poor th moose. Is it a robot moose? I think it's a robo moose. Hybrid. Uh, what do you call that? A cyborg moose. A moose. <laughs> a moose. A reconstructed caribou. Suddenly attacked. Oh, wow. That certainly is yep. a reconstructed caribou. This is. I'm a little bit intimidated, but I'll be honest. It's power um, bash up to death. There, you got it. Alright, Duster, what's he gonna do? Pin an enemy yeah, down. I wonder yeah, if that's useful. Yeah, why not? Let's, let's see if it works. Sniff it. Sniff it. Yeah, let's just let's sniff it. He smells like a mechanical chimera. Smells weak against lightning. Is that how you say that, by the way? Ch chimera. 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 Chimere. Chim chimere. Chimere. Smells I've weak. I've heard it pronounced many ways. <laughs> Sorry, it was chimera though, right? Okay. Yeah. Um, yeah. Smells weak against numbness. The reconstructed caribou generated an intense burst of steam. Duster through wall staples. Stay down. He was pinned down. <laughs> He still missed! Wow. Should I try it again? Maybe I should toughen it. Actually, I'm gonna do some buffs. Let's get some okay, defense. That makes sense. Um, that way the reconstructed caribou can't one-shot your entire party. Mm. Yeah, I haven't seen this thing go for it yet, but, you know, when he goes for it. Can um, anyone in your party do the, like, rhythm attack, or is it just the head of the party? I think anybody could do it. But I'm not sure what the beat is here. Because it's usually quite fast. Um, and this sounds like a slower song, but I'm guessing it's like on the... Up like, on the snare. Da, 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 you know, I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, he broke free! He went berserk! Oof. Bony! No, Bony's gonna die! Heal him, heal him. Oh, Bony! Oh, no, I wasn't fast enough. See? This is what I was talking about. Rest in peace, Bony. We gotta keep Flint alive. Um, but we also, he's the best attacker, so maybe we'll, um... Oh, well, let's staple him down again. Let's see if we can do that. Yeah. I forgot. Do you use a specific item to revive party members, or do you just heal them above yeah. zero? Um, I don't think that I have anything that can revive someone who's fallen. Oh, he's not holding any stuff. Oh, they all have their own inventories here. Uh, Brutal. He'll survive, though. If another hit, I think. And he's pinned down right now. In fact, maybe we'll... Can we pin him down twice? Just keep him stunlocked. Oh, no, he can't. 
Ah, oh, darn it. Oh no, Dester. Hold on. Oh, yeah, it is fast. It's really fast. the song or does it follow a specific instrument it's a, uh it's i think the timing the beat but it's like on the quarter notes or something so it's like um it's quick so if you hear the snare i don't know i think it's like you know it's like it's yeah. like quick but it's a it's hard to do that i ain't a drummer Oh shoot, I should have pinned him down again. Oops. Oh, and he's dying. Duster died! It's just me now. Oh, thank goodness. Yeah, you got, we got him. him. The reconstructed caribou stopped moving. Ominous. Oh, and how does it feel to kill a reconstructed caribou? A little bad, but like, what was it gonna do? Flint earned 112 experience points. No one else how got any. For no, yeah, none of your other party. Whoops. Brutal. That's okay. Flynn's obviously gonna stick around, and everyone else is gonna leave your party at some point. Yeah, Hi. the one thing I know about fiction is your dad never dies. Lying on the ground is a notebook with a pig nose like mark on the cover. Give it a read. It's probably not in English, right? Flint picked up the notebook and read it. The following is written in poor handwriting All the creatures around here suck. <laughs> we need to make them cooler. Oh, so yeah. the theme will be tougher, rougher, badder. We'll mix and match this and that to create whole new things no one's ever seen before. I dub it the Fascinating Chimera Project. Let's reconstruct and modify stuff slowly and steadily. Hmm. I don't like the sound of that. Alright, we really need to heal mm -hmm. up. I'm like debating going all the way back to the... Um, the safe point that's right down there to this hot, oh, spring. hot spring maybe no. there's one up ahead okay yeah, let's at least give you... i'll save before we continue on because i'm you know duster and uh bony are like dead they're dead they're dead <laughs> <laughs> they're just you know they're the walking dead okay uh <laughs> this machine is uh not nice i like that they have different walk stomp sounds on the metal. Mm. Oh. Whoa! Check that out. That? What the? It's a flying pig. It's a flying pig saucer. They got away. It's just like Porky. Chirp chirp. From that other game of mother. Sparrow advice. Allow me to explain skills to you. Oh, sorry for being so sudden. Anyway. You and all your party members have special skills you can use during battle. These skills might be centered around items, physical actions, or whatever else. Basically, it's different for each person. For details, press start to bring up the menu, and from there, you can check everyone's skills from the status screen. It'll, it'd be a real waste to neglect your special skills, so give it a try. Well, now to end this with a sparrow-like chirp. Okay, thanks. I think I knew that stuff already. Is this just a dead end? Oh. Nowhere to go? I guess we have to go back. Mm -hmm. Maybe they've cleared the uh... The trees now. Yeah. Or maybe... Did I miss anything in this cave? Excuse me. No, the cave was a dead end. Yeah? Uh, yeah, it was just like a... Uh, ledges. Yeah. That's okay, let's get out of here. Okay, let's get I'm glad the thief arts proved useful. The thief arts, like stapling. <laughs> but our problem still hasn't been solved. Everyone seems so cold. I'm actually burning up though. Mm, well, he's got corona. Uh oh. Burr, so cold. I hope Hanawa. Ah, 
Ah, phew, doesn't catch cold too. Why's oh. everyone so cold? It's a cold night. Wet. Cold, wet night. Flint! Oh, true. We found the kids! It seems they fell into the river and washed up here. I'll look after Boney. You just hurry and see him. Come, Boney. Goodbye, best character in the game. Mm, Boney. Boney deserves better. Hanam is a wonderful person, so I'm sure God will look out for her. Tessie's tending to the kids right now. Hurry and go see them. Flint, we found the children. Okay, we're going. I just want to talk to everybody. We did it! We did it, Flint! With everyone working together, there's nothing we can't do! Oh yeah, now you say that. I think these two are supposed to be like a comedy routine or something. Yeah. Oh yeah. There's always the tall skinny guy and the short, uh, broad man. And they... the two stooges. Is this like a reference I, I to some Japanese comedians I'll never get? It must be, I don't know. Like some specific Japanese slapstick, comedians? Slapstick Not just routine. a trope? Possible. Still haven't healed, but I don't think they're gonna send anything else right now. Let's go see our kids. Oh, Flint, Duster! This way, this way! My kids! Aw, oh, the boys! They're on but fire. Hinawa's not here. Dad! made some in it tea, Flint. Please have some. They'll warm you up. Aw, oh, their clothes are drying. Here, everyone else should take a break and get warm too. In it tea. Is tea in it? In it. Is that the joke? I think maybe. Nice. Can't be sure. Aw, oh, they're shivering. I wonder where Claus and Lucas fell into the river. In any case, I'm just glad they're okay. I wonder what they'll get to eat when their mom gets back. I hope she comes back soon. I guess they still haven't found Hanawa. Where the heck could she be? Thank goodness they're okay. What a relief. We haven't found Hanawa yet, but for now, you should warm yourself up by the fire. If you keep this up, you'll wind off worse than her. It seems they both fell into the river and got washed downstream. Poor little things. Aw. Dad. The children's clothes are being held to dry, okay? We gotta go find an outlet, right? You can find fire? Flint! Flint. I'm not sure what to say, but... Just stay calm and hear me out. I have good news, I have bad news. Which do you want to hear first? No, let me start with the good news first. I picked up a giant drago fang. It'll make for a great weapon. I figured you could probably use it. As for the bad news. The bad news is... It's where I found the Drago Fang. It was in your... It was pierced through your wife's heart. Oh my god. Flint, just try to stay calm. I think the only reason Claus and Lucas are safe and sound now is because Hanawa risked her life to protect them. Flint. Oof. Wow.
Flint. Flint, I'm not sure what to say. Please try to pull yourself together. Oof. Flint, what are you doing? Claus and Lucas are watching. Oh god. Goodbye, Hanala. This will never be tasting her omelets ever again. Truly. I can't believe he was like, hey, I found this cool knife. Also. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> no one's ever been thrown into Tasmali's jail before. You have the honor of being the first. Are these like bird sounds or Flint we gave Ali, Ali and Abbott a real walloping but they're all right now about Hanawa I can only offer my deepest condolences still why would a drago attack someone they're such friendly creatures take it easy in here for a while I know you must be having a hard time with this but try to get some sleep the drago fang that was stuck in Hanala's chest. I'll hold on to it for you. When you get out of here, come drop by my house and get it. Don't forget now. So, like, drago? A drago? Drago. But the dragos are friendlier than they look. The harder you hit them, the more they like it. So why would they... They have friendly eyes do such a terrible thing. Mm. Modified Drago? Maybe we'll find out next time. Amaro Draco? On a the very next special episode. <laughs> Mother 3. The game is named after her. I don't think it's actually... I don't, I don't actually know why yeah, it's called Mother. Yeah, if it was named um, after her, they would have called it Dead Mother 1. Oh, yeah. Dead <laughs> Oof. Oof. Alright, well, I think that about wraps this one up. If you're watching, thanks for watching. <laughs>